Welcome to season one of Steve G. Jones Hypnosis. And what we're going to do is we're going to take my cleaning person, who's Sarah. She's also a friend of mine. And I'm also friends with her ex-husband, Jonathan. And we're going to uh, use her as a case study and she's going to benefit from it as well. She's going to uh, get some free hypnosis sessions. Uh, she's going to get to get to the heart of some of the challenges that she's having because here's what's going on. Sarah is constantly complaining about money. It's just a constant situation. For example, she'll, she'll come in to clean for me and she'll say, I need $3,000. And of course, she doesn't make that much cleaning per week. She makes uh, about $80 a week cleaning. So she'll say, I need $3,000. And I'll say, why? She'll say, because my air conditioning went out. And uh, I'll, I'll say, well, I, I wish I could help you, but I really don't have uh, you know, that much cleaning for you. So this sort of thing keeps happening. Sarah talking about money. Sarah talking about a gap between where she is and where she wants to be financially. So I thought, well, what a beautiful case study this would be. If we could take Sarah, of all people, and get her from where she is to where she wants to be, and if we can come along for the ride. Because a lot of times people have challenges in their lives and they don't realize that other people are having the same challenges. They think they're isolated and they're living in a bubble and it's, they're the only ones having that challenge. So I suspect a lot of the viewers have the same or similar challenges. And I suspect that by following Sarah in her journey, wherever it goes, people can relate to it. And they'll be able to say, yeah, that's me. That's a part of me being portrayed there on the screen. That's a part of what I'm going through. And maybe it's not exact, but I can relate to that. I can get some benefit from that. I can take from Sarah's example of pain and hopefully triumph, and I can go along for that hero's journey with her, or at least empathize with her and, and get some insight that uh, I'm not alone in, in what I'm going through. Because a lot of people are facing financial hardships, and that's not related to any one economic period of time. That's all the time. There's always somebody who's going through economic hardships, and it's more popular than a lot of us would like to admit. So. I want the viewers to realize that as we follow her through her development, through getting comfortable with having money and a few other challenges that we'll probably encounter, that you can put yourself into this and you can look at yourself in your own struggle. What's your struggle? Is it weight loss? Is it having more motivation? Is it having more confidence? Is it uh, having a better relationship? What is it? Because I think we're going to get into a lot of areas with Sarah, but even the areas we don't get into, you can realize that this is a human being a human being having struggles similar to the struggles that we all face. So join me in this journey. We're going to see where it goes. We're going to see what happens with Sarah. We're going to see what we can do. And I think it's going to be fascinating. I'm Steve G. Jones, clinical hypnotherapist, inviting you to join me on this wonderful, amazing journey.